feed uh, is a very good platform i am very frank about that i was a constant student of speed i know in and out of and i think you go for a speed especially a cheap part so the quality of teaching speed is uh, unmatchable sir that is that is the true yeah, i bring in all the wishes and greetings and behalf of all the faculty members of speed medical institute dr mohammad hamsa for scoring rank number 4 in aml a topmost rank in mcs surgical gastroenterology in any ss session may 20 25 congratulations to you doctor thank you thank you sir very thank you and i also thank for your allocating your valuable time to share your experiences about this exam and preparation with us and to the students okay sir Now, can we know your detailed background history from where you started your career till date? What all you have done, sir? Basically, I have started my career. I have done my undergraduate from AIMS Patna. Then I have done MS surgery from AIMS Patna, and then I have completed my senior residency in January two thousand two thousand twenty five this year only in from AIMS Patna, and uh, thereafter I got a three to four months time to prepare for. Uh, this exam and i was there in the list very good now can we know why surgical gastroenterology is your choice of specialty sir uh, why while working with my guide i was so influenced by the the surgery gi surgery he was performing especially oesophagectomy and whipples and all colectomies so by that time i was uh, i was very excited to go into the field so i was having very passion of hpb surgery that's why i have chosen this sir then what happened once you decided to go for mca surgical gastroenterology as your specialty and what all you did to achieve uh, a rank today and what was your preparation strategy how much of time could allocate for that so uh, for getting the surgical gastro seat uh, i was knowing that uh, sir i was i got a uh, good rank in neat also i got 170 last year i was getting uh, good college gpa but uh, i was in a mood to study at aims only that's why i left the seat last year also and the previous session also aims seat i was getting bopal i was in you know to go for delhi or my so uh, aims new delhi yes sir is something like that i want to study from aims and or, or my choice that is i am from patna so i i want to prefer there also So, uh, so for I was only preparing for sir I and I only. I was not uh, focused on neat assess. I was very clear about my thought. Uh, my senior also told me not to uh, lose that seat. This is very important. But I was very clear in my thought to I will get uh, SGE seat. So for GI surgery, I I sir uh, totally rely on the Bassans or notes. It was uh, it was something like I have. Uh, studied like uh, skin to skin and the <laughs> way the, the way sir teaches teaches uh, it is uh, the paper was very simple for me for gi gi part all problem for me is what sir getting general surgery i, I have a issue to forget the stuffs uh, general surgery memory based question i this time also i have met a uh, few question of memory based only wrong asa and all basic stuff and uh, but Uh, overall paper was good i prepared last time with uh, general surgery with uh, your uh, previous year question also sir it helped me a lot because every time i got stuck with the general surgery part because my gi surgery was quite clear so i this time i focus on general surgery still i got a uh, few four to five silly mistakes but uh, still i got uh, able to achieve rank four the this time great great friend Great doctor. Now, can we know how many questions did you attend this exam? Sir, I have attended seventy-eight uh, uh, questions. Sir, I have uh, uh, left two question. One was that who, who performed the first TEP, and other question was something related to the basics of uh, laparoscopic surgery, FLS guidelines. Something was that. Then I have attended seventy-eight question. In that, uh, I got to check that. I remember all the eighty questions, sir. line to line so i got uh, in gi surgery it was almost uh, um, uh, 50 out of in gi surgery around 55 question was there and i was able to score very good in gi surgery general surgery part i have made few mistakes very good so the, so the number of questions you answered uh, i have attempted 78 uh, questions sir right 
Doctor, what would be a message for the future aspirants of uh, MCHSE? Uh, sir, first of all, sir, I would like to uh, thanks to Almighty, the God and my family, my siblings, my wife also supported me during this uh, tough preparation because it is uh, to getting into AIMS SG is was is a difficult journey for me because doing a residency SR ship and studying with it was a difficult for me uh, to my juniors who is coming i think the speed uh, is a very good platform i am very frank about that i was a constant student of speed i know in and out of and i think you go for a speed especially a ge part and so your uh, previous year question discussion are very important and i think for a ge the basans or notes is more than sufficient and the aims is going again and again the notes will be sufficient even from the notes i have made few mistakes in peanut and that is creating a problem but otherwise yeah, yeah speed note is more than sufficient sir you get into top 10 top 5 or most of the time you will be there in top 5 <laughs> yes that's what is happening for past 6 uh, 7 years yes i'm i'm damn sure the quality of teaching speed is un- unmatchable sir that is that is the true because at aims uh, uh it it's what it's all about the test they they test your con- concept and they test uh, how you approach the paper so that is after studying from speed night is very much clear that the option will be very evident to you this is the answer <laughs> so and uh, time to thank and whom all you want to thank that from day one till day they help you to what you are today in your career Uh, sir i have told that i first of all almighty and then my parents siblings my wife oh, he used to teach me general surgery i was very weak at general surgery sir <laughs> because i used to forget the stuffs and that create a problem because in such a difficult exam this uh, only two to three question will let you on in the top 5 or out of the top 10 i have uh, last uh, november i got rank 16 sir in cml i was 11 on the previous session i got rank 11 so i was constant in the list but uh, i i was only general surgery part was uh, and this time sir i i one thing i want to tell my juniors is that like getting marks in theory is is relatively easy when you study basans or notes and uh, general surgery part but if for interview you have to be very much prepared i think the basans sir has uh, uh, teaches us how to approach because in both the interview i was at only i got 10 marks but this time i got a very good mark so that i was in the top 5 list so prepare for interview and be very confident and uh, uh, try to crack as much of oski you can and uh, i think it will be but it should be concerned that everyone thinks that if if i get a good marks in theory i will be there it is not like that you have to prepare for interview in a very holistic fashion so that the examiner know that apart from theory you have the approach to to deal with a patient and uh, to get a good marks to and finally good good rank great so we, what i could see was and observe was that you were in the list but you are not taking the seat yes sir it was like that i was uh, very much sir i i want to study from my choice college and i was not very much satisfied with my preparation also because yes sir it's, it's it's very difficult to work and study because i have completed my sr ship in january this year only so it was very difficult and uh, but uh, because of sir uh, this speed platform especially basan sir i was there in the list again and again because i used to blindly study all from his notes and concept and after that paper seems to be not very difficult for me great doctor so we once again wish you all the very best and all the success for a great 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 career as an mc surgical gastroenterologist and best thank, wishes. thank you thank you sir thank you